Good morning, guys. Um, I have got to say that I'm really sorry that there wasn't a vlog or a daily vlog yesterday. Um, I just didn't feel like I could. Um, a lot was going on. Um, my the person I liaise with from social services came up here. She took a very long time to get here and a very long time to get home so I couldn't vlog it while she was here because we had a lot to do a lot to squeeze into a small amount of time and obviously to make that easier for her I tried to do as much as I could before and after her arrival as well um, and that took up quite a lot of the time also I just felt like I looked now the whole day and no one really wants to see that to be honest with you so I decided that I wasn't gonna I wasn't gonna vlog and then I also didn't vlog because I didn't really have much to say only I've been doing paperwork and no one wants to read that so I didn't do that um, I don't know what I'm doing today um, what I am gonna show you though one thing I did discover yesterday is over in the common room is just a dump because international students have been leaving and obviously they can't take anything with them they can only take what they can take on a plane so they have literally dumped everything I went over there I scavenged two pairs of shoes two pans a pan lid a pizza pan thing felt somebody put pizza in to put in the oven um, a colander soy sauce balsamic vinegar I came back with so much stuff um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over there again to show you but there isn't, I've went, I've gone through it all now, there isn't really anything unless some people have added more stuff, there isn't really anything else over there that I'm interested in um, but I should really show you what everyone has left behind because I didn't show you yesterday because I was um, looking like this. Um, so I will show you that. Um, um, the other thing I don't really uh, other thing other things wise. Oh my god, I can't if I could speak. Other things wise, I don't really know if anything else is going to happen today. I just made myself a coffee. Um, but other than that, nothing's going on. Um, so I will have to let you know. Later in the day. Oh dear, that was rude. I would have to let you know later in the day. Um, when stuff is occurring, what it is. Because right now, nothing's happening, to be honest. But I am going to vlog. I'm going to do my best to make it interesting and let's go. So guys, I'm ready now. I am just about to make my way to Sainsbury's because I've run out of food and I need to go shopping. Um, the other thing is I've got an email notification for another one of my deliveries having arrived, but obviously I don't want to go and collect it until the very last minute because anything else could arrive between the email notification and me going again. I've noticed actually that I don't get an email until a good couple of hours after it's actually arrived there. So if I wait until like three o'clock, some another thing my my have arrived but I might not have got the email yet so I'm gonna do that I'm gonna wait until like three o'clock before I go over there um, but I'm just gonna go over to Sainsbury's now hopefully I won't be there that long this time I'm not gonna make the same mistake as I did last time because I'm gonna drive um, I'm not intending to get as much as I did last time though but I'm still gonna drive because I still won't be able to get back over here and it's not so nice a day either so I don't particularly want to walk um, but yeah we will see all right guys well today has been very expensive i went over to i was going to go over to sainsbury's like i said in the car and i couldn't start the car battery was flat again my car had got to the point where every time i got in the car it needed to be jump started um so the guy at the the guy who's like the head of management at this part of the accommodation was in the reception and he came and helped me he jump started the car so I thought, right, rather than go to Sainsbury's, because I might get there and not not be able to get out again 
I'll go to Halfords and see what the problem is. So they did a battery test and they told me basically you need a new battery now, otherwise um, you're just never going to get anywhere again. So <laughs> I bought a new battery and the price of the battery was £43 and the price of installation was £10. So at Halfords I spent £53. I then went to Sainsbury's and I only got a couple of bits this time. I didn't do a full shop. I only got um, a few bits and pieces because obviously where I'm going to be moving flat again, I don't want there to be too much in the fridge um, when I move over into the next flat because um, obviously that's just a pain if I forget anything if I forget to empty the fridge then like they've left all my food behind um, but also I hope and then I can do a new shop when I'm in the new house to replenish the cupboard in the fridge but that cost me nearly 30 pound so 50 just over 50 quid for a battery and just under 30 pound for food so I spent a lot of money today but on the good on a good note um, the delivery arrived that was the other color of my ombre um, that I'm gonna be doing now so it might be quite late by the time I vlog again just because of how long it's how much longer it takes to do a gradual a gradual color than it does to just whack it all on um, so next time I vlog might be quite late at night but you will get to see the finished product um, of my hair colour um, and yeah we'll see how it goes obviously if it goes wrong I won't be vlogging I'm not going to vlog it if it's bad um, so if it goes bad I'm not going to vlog it just because it's embarrassing so the next time I vlog if that happens will be by the when it's fixed again um, but in theory this should go well so we will have to see um, and I will catch up with you in a bit right I am halfway through I'm just waiting for the development time to end and then I'm gonna go wash it out um, I thought I'd vlog now just because I look hilarious with um, tinfoil hanging out on my head I thought I looked like a Christmas decoration um, <laughs> But I thought I'd vlog it just so you could see how funny I look. Um, I've only got eight minutes left and then I have to go and get in the shower, wash it out. Um, and then I might show you and I might not, just depends on how it goes. So guys, it worked exactly as I thought it was going to. Um, obviously I want to brighten it up a little bit more. So I'm going to reapply it. I don't know if you can see the colour. There we go. Um, I'm going to reapply it and maybe leave it on for a bit longer um, just to brighten it up a bit um, I'm also going to reapply the dark colour on the top because some of it um, has already been rinsed out where I washed it quite a few times to try and get this bit to be lighter before I applied this um, so I'll reapply the top as well and then there'll definitely be a colour difference it'll be a really dark almost black blue down to a turquoise aquarish type colour which is not quite there yet it's not quite some of it is better than other bits it just depends on um, the quality of hair there um, and the colour it was before but I am um, going to continue playing with it until I'm finally happy that it's 100% perfect but I'm really happy with how it's turned out today um, so I hope um, that when I reapply it it will all come out and be fine, perfect the way I want it to be, but yep. So guys, I have an additional segment that I want to add to our vlogs. Um, obviously it's not going to be as often as um, daily. Oh, someone's going. What are you doing? They interrupt the vlog. Um, <laughs> what I do have to add to the vlog is the fact that I have started growing, or trying to grow, an avocado tree. 
Um, what I'm going to show you, what we're going to do, is we are going to follow the progress of the tree as it grows. Um, which hopefully is going to be really cool. Um, because my friend, my friend showed me online the instructions of how to do it. Um, and I, um, she did it a lot earlier than me and I decided that I was going to do it as well. And she sent me a photo of hers and it's actually like a proper tree, like it's about six inches tall, has like proper leaves on it, like proper waxy leaves. Um, but this is the current, um, this is the current state of mine. Um, if you Google how to grow an avocado tree, you'll get loads of instructions um, as to how to grow it. That's mine at the moment. Nothing has currently happened. It hasn't cracked yet. Um, basically, at the next stage, when we get to the next stage of the instructions, that's when I will vlog it again and show you what has happened, how it's progressed, um, and what the difference is in it. But that's only like a small segment that will only occur occasionally because obviously the avocado stone isn't going to change every day so it's not me show worth me showing you the thing in the glass every single day when it looks identical then you won't notice the change whereas if i do it a little bit by little bit every now and then you'll notice that it changes um so yeah so i went back to bed and had a nap <laughs> Um, I'm just getting back up again now. It's like half nine, I think. Um, <laughs> just fell over. That's all right. Yeah, it's twenty five past nine now. Um, as I'm tired enough to have just kind of casually gone back to bed and had a nap, I think what I'm gonna do now then is oh god, I can't even. I just can't even. Um, what I'm gonna do now is. <laughs> is end the vlog here and edit it and get it uploaded now and I will write the blog and all that jazz now so until tomorrow goodbye